The animal kingdom is a beautiful yet terrifying world, but the animals we have today are nothing compared with the nightmare-inducing prehistoric monsters that once existed. You won't believe that they are actually real and that nature could have produced such beasts of terror. Can you imagine a two-meter-long centipede crawling around or a deadly giant scorpion swimming with you in the lake? or a saber-toothed cat whose canine measures a foot long. This is Derek, and thanks for joining us for Mind Read. In this episode, we take a look at six most terrifying extinct creatures ever. And after watching this episode, you'll be doing a dance of joy that they no longer exist. Just make sure to stay on until the end of the video, because number one is truly horrifying. Number six, Smilodon. This prehistoric terror lived sometime from 10,000 to 2.5 million years ago. It was the largest saber-toothed cat that ever lived and measured approximately 5 feet long, 3 feet in height and weighed around 440 to 600 pounds. This means it is slightly smaller than our lions today but heavier. They're often referred to as tigers, but they actually belong to the family of cheetahs and lions. So what's scary about this extinct cat? They sported canine teeth that measured seven inches long and sometimes even grew to almost a foot. The Smilodon's teeth were brittle. They would often break when used and did not grow back, but that doesn't make them less dangerous because they had very powerful jaws. Their jaws opened to an angle of 120 degrees as compared to the lion's 65 degree angle opening. Strong jaws and neck muscles allowed these fierce predators to latch on to their poor prey with their fearsome canines. And though they were not very fast runners, their front legs were very powerful and were built for springing on their prey. Number 5. Arthropleura a lot of people, not all, are freaked out by bugs, but if a two meter long bug shows up, I'm pretty sure everyone will be freaked out. Well, the Arthropleura, which lived around 300 million years ago, grew as long as 2.6 meters. Yes, as long as a car or as tall as a human. Can you even imagine that? The Arthropleura were distant relatives of modern millipedes and centipedes. They lived during the Carboniferous period and started having difficulty surviving when the oxygen levels on Earth started dropping. During the Permian period, when previously lush forests became dry and had too little rain to support vegetation, they slowly crept their way to extinction. Lucky for us, we no longer see this man-sized creepy crawler surprising us from the bushes. Number 4. Jacolopterus You know what's worse than coming face to face with a scorpion? Coming face to face with a giant scorpion. The Jacolopterus was the biggest anthropos ever discovered. It is called the giant sea scorpion. But places where the water creature was found indicate that it probably inhabited freshwater systems. This top predator that ruled the waters 390 million years ago grew to a length that may well have exceeded 8 feet, not even counting its chelicerae, which adds up another meter to its already staggering length. It had a segmented body with specialized limbs some of which had spikes. This terrifying sea monster was first discovered when the remains of its claw was discovered by Simon Brady and Marcus Porschman of the University of Bristol. They discovered its 18-inch claw-like proboscis from the rocks of Rhineland, Germany. The size of the claw shed light that, contrary to what scientists previously thought, creatures such as spiders, insects, and crabs must be way bigger than the previous assumptions. And its growth was largely attributed to the prevailing level of atmospheric oxygen during that time. The sheer size of this spiky marine creature just goes to show that it was the most powerful anthropod that ever lived. Number three, Sarcosuchus. The Sarcosuchus, which is Greek for flesh crocodile, is probably more popularly known as Supercroc. It belongs to the extinct genus of Crocodiliaform that lived 129 million years ago. Modern day crocodiles reached their full adult size in around 10 years, the longest of which measured 25 feet. 
while the Super Crocs continue to grow through the course of its lifetime and is believed could have reached up to 40 feet or more in length and 4.7 tons in weight. Not only do they grow bigger than today's crocodile, they also live longer. The average lifespan of present-day crocodiles is around 25 years. The sarcosuchus, according to this study on some of the croc's osteoderms, revealed that the specimen was already 40 years old, yet had not attained full maturity at the time of its death. Just how old do they get? and how big do they grow? With its massive size, in order to keep its body going, it would also require a massive source of sustenance, which probably consists of dinosaurs and large lobed finned fish. It is believed that the only factor that limited their growth is the availability of food supply. And let us not forget their other terrifying features. They have muscular tails, powerful jaws and muscles, sharp teeth, and plates that cover their whole body. To date, the Sarcosuchus remains the biggest crocodile to ever roam the Earth. Number 2. Megalodon our next feature would make Jaws look like a preschooler. Meet the Megalodon. This truly gigantic predatory shark was said to grow 60 feet in length and weigh around 30 to 50 tons. And because sharks don't have bone skeletons, the estimate of their size depended on their teeth size as compared to other sharks. Most of the recovered teeth fossils of the Megalodon date back to as early as 23 million years ago, and the size was usually around 4 inches to 5 inches, though there were a few that reached the 7 inch mark. This was why the giant predator was named Megalodon, which means big tooth. They are believed to have the strongest bite force of any animal, but it was usually used to render their prey immobile through biting off their victim's tails and fins. The ocean terror is believed to have gone extinct 16 million to 2 million years ago. It is said that the cause of their extinction started when the Earth underwent a cooling period. This started a drop in the ocean's temperature and subsequently caused a significant drop as well in whale population. It can be said that the massive size of the megalodon affected its evolutionary success greatly because the bigger the creature is, the more food it would naturally need. With the disappearance of large whale populations, this meant that the food supply available to this colossal terror of the ocean greatly dwindled. Though the sea monster is extinct, many still believe that the megalodon shark still roams the oceans. Many think that it may be inhabiting the depths of the Mariana Trench. And because there is very little research about this deepest point of the Earth, nobody really knows what kind of strange creatures inhabit its depths. Number 1. Titanoboa The Titanoboa, the largest serpent that ever slithered on the face of the Earth. They lured it over the South American jungles five million years after the dinosaurs disappeared. The monster snake was discovered as a team of scientists were excavating at the Cerrajón coal mine in La Guajira, Colombia. Research on the area started as a student discovered a fossilized leaf that suggested an ancient rainforest in the area. Expeditions ensued and fossils were collected, but the most celebrated find was that of a species of snake that was never discovered before. One so large it seemed almost unreal and made the largest anaconda find today pale in comparison. The titanoboa is unequaled. It looks a lot like the present-day boa constrictor, but its behavior is more like that of an anaconda, a water dweller. Estimated to have 250 vertebrae, fossil finds also show that the usual adult size of this extinct species must be around 42 feet in length against the present-day anaconda's average 21.3 feet. Some grew even way over 50 feet in length. Its width in its thickest part measured over 3 feet, or as high as a grown man's waist, and weighed as much as 2,500 pounds, or double the weight of a polar bear. It was one fearsome predator that could swallow up any animal that caught its fancy. And with this silent hunter, no animal stood a chance. Everything is over in a flash. Snap! 
Now, aren't we all grateful that these prehistoric terrors are no longer around? Again, thank you for always dropping by. Hope you liked today's show. If you did, please drop us a like and share this video with your friends. And if you haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to tap the button and tap on the bell so that you always get updated about our latest creepy content. This has been Derek for Mind Read. Thanks again and see you on our next countdown.